now we're in the swell division, and this division is likewise enclosed behind swell shades in just the same way. So the sound can be, we call it expressive sound in uh, organ terms, musical terms. And all the pipe work except for one set is uh, installed now. And uh, that set is just being uh, finished up and will be in probably in a few days here. So you can see we've got a lot of different shapes and sizes here too. Metal pipes, wooden pipes. Uh, we talked about the slotted pipes here last week. Very small pipes here, four uh, ranks of mixture. Reed pipes on each side of the walk board because reed pipes tend to, uh, we tend to tune those to the rest of the organ. So to have the reeds uh, next to the walk board is very convenient for easy accessibility and tuning. So reeds here, reeds here. The uh, Vox Humana, which is another different type of a reed stop, is going to go here where you can see the uh, empty toe holes still on the chest. Wooden flute pipes, um, principal pipes, string pipes, um, uh, conical flute celeste pipes back here that are, were another very special uh, Skinner development. And you can see the, the difference in the uh, metal composition, for instance, uh, between this pipe, which is spotted metal, uh, string, and you can see very clearly the beard here. That's a little, it's basically like a wooden dowel, painted black in this case, that helps to stabilize uh, tone in some pipes. Uh, if you compare this metal to this, you can see they look very different. They're even different in their weights. So this is a much heavier pipe. There's probably a lot more uh, lead, I'm guessing, in this. But you can see from appearance, and I can tell you from, from weight, that they are uh, quite different. So uh, the metal composition of organ pipes influences their tone in a big way. Oops, wonder why that wasn't fitting. There we are, much happier. 